Welcome to the Booze How To's Fruit Beer Tutorial. My name is Shirley Warren and I'm going to teach you how to make a four fruit ale. I've been brewing for about 25 years. I started in my family's kitchen. My parents were home brewers and when I decided to go off to university, I too decided along with my sister that we should brew beer as well. So we, we, we got our kit together and started brewing beer and in retrospect, it was, it was pretty wretched stuff but we drank it anyway, along with some unsuspecting friends. When I graduated, I moved to Toronto, and uh, by luck, by chance, I got a job at a microbrewery, and uh, I thought, wow, this is the beginning of my professional brewing career. Hand labeling bottles, hour after hour, day after day. It took me months to move up uh, into the conditioning room, where I mostly froze to death. Uh, um, learning how to transfer beer, filter beer, vacuum yeast off the top of fermenting beer, and fixing a very cantankerous uh, bottling line that seemed to break down every time we fired it up. Uh, eventually I moved into the brew house where I apprenticed under the brewmaster and learned all of the operations of the brew house. Uh, I was there for a bit and, and then uh, decided to move on and started working in uh, brew pubs, which I found much, much more interesting. Uh, we could virtually brew any style of beer we wanted. We, we did a lot of experimenting, and um, that's where I, I really learned how to design beers. It was around that time that I went to Quebec City to visit my older sister, and she turned me on to some Belgian beers that I'd never tasted. Uh, uh, they were Lambic fruit beers, Creek, and framboise, and I just thought they were the best beers I'd ever tasted. Uh, and I've been brewing fruit beers ever since. I've brewed fruit beers with pretty much every fruit you can imagine. Blueberries, blackberries, raspberries, strawberries, cherries, peaches, apricots. Any fruit with a robust character, a robust flavor and, and aroma uh, are perfect for, for brewing fruit beers. Uh, the most interesting thing about brewing fruit beers is that um, because the fruit is so complex, each time you brew with the fruit, you'll get varying results, which are, I find really interesting. Um, these beers are the most wonderful, crisp, quaffable beers you'll ever drink, and, and I'm going to teach you how to make one. 